Okay. Let's see how we go with this one. This will be an interesting one. So we're going to make this probably a negative image, this one. This will be an interesting one if we can make it look nice. I'm actually thinking it might have to be, again, 210. So 210. Okay. I wonder what background colour we're going to give it. We're just going to leave it out for this. We're going back here. We're not going to make it too cold. We're just going to make it and the red, I'm thinking the red, we're just going to go not quite all the way. I've already done that one. Okay, let's see how we go with this. This is yoga. It's a yoga flyer. So it's a yoga, it is a flyer, and we're just going to photocopy the, I think we're going to have to make this a lot larger than uh, 210, because it's all the way down there. Um, we probably don't have to really, but we're going to, I think. So we're going to make this a bit longer. So we're going to make it 230. I think that's pretty much the size we're going to make it. Let's see how we go with it. I'm not into yoga. I don't believe in it. It's not my cup of tea. I've got my reasons why I don't like yoga. Yoga is a really soft and mushy sounding name for it. Certain kinds of exercise and meditations. Uh, I don't like meditating either. So I'm not into that spiritual shit. I'm not into chakras. I'm not into uh, crystal healing and all that sort of shit doesn't go I don't know if yoga is really associated with that but it's a different type of thing that I just don't like uh, well that looks interesting <laughs> and we've made that look interesting I'm wondering if we're going to do another version or if we're going to keep it like that uh, I'm wondering where the middle of this is going to go this looks like a middle because of the clouds but then the person there looks like it's going to make a good middle so we're just going to try and decide. We're just going to throw this on the recycle. But basically, I just don't like yoga or anything like that. It's just not my cup of tea, fucks, folks. Sorry, why do I say fucks? Why do I say that? Sorry, folks. I didn't mean to say that. Uh, I'm going to have to overlap it a bit on the edge. But basically, yeah, I'm just not into yoga or spiritualism. I've got my own spiritual beliefs, um, but I'm not into this kind of stuff. But yoga is a very popular activity. A lot of people report that it's good for stress management and shit like that. It's not my thing. It's not something I would want to do. It's just not my cup of tea as I just said at least twice <laughs> uh, but it, it's, it's, it's an interesting practice I guess you could say it's quite fascinating what people find makes them feel better you know what makes what basically floats their boat so to speak what floats their boat for me yoga isn't something that floats my proverbial boat um, but a lot of people I do respect that people do believe that yoga is good. I do respect that. I mean, we all we all have different opinions and shit, and we just have to get on with each other and and not shoot each other down just because we don't agree, whether it be spiritual or racial or cultural or whatever. Uh, we all have to sort of 
coexist in this world. And this looks shit. Look at that. It's all backgroundy. I want to get rid of that, but that looks nice. So we're just going to make this look interesting. Uh, we're going to have to somehow do something. I think the background removal could be very handy for this. We're going all the way with it. So we're going to try and add that in. But yeah, we all have to get on with each other, you know, in this world. And it's a really difficult world. And, you know, people, there's all sorts of things dividing people, like socioeconomic status, for example, is a big one. How much money you earn and all that sort of shit. And it's really, we don't need that shit in this world. You know, worrying about how much money we make and whether we're better than the next person because we've got more money and more possessions, you know, keeping up with the fucking Joneses. We don't want this sort of shit. We want people to coexist. And unfortunately, the rich people in particular don't allow it and they couldn't give a fuck if the poor people were to pass away because of poverty. So that's not fair. That's not acceptable. Uh... I don't know how I tend to get angry at the rich. I tend to discriminate against them because they kind of discriminate against people of lower socioeconomic status. And I am one of the lower people. I'm not a rich person. I can barely keep my fucking uh, shit together when it comes to bills and expenses that I, I'm trying to get a viral uh, social media uh campaign happening and it's just taking a long time and a lot of videos a lot of data I mean fortunately I've got a bottomless pit of data I've got a unlimited data plan which is good for all this uploading of videos and shit but it's really a strain on the budget doing this uh, and I don't have a big budget so and the rich people, if I told them, they'd probably say, oh, don't spend too much on fucking data. Or don't, why did you buy that photocopier for? Why did you take out that bank loan on a fucking photocopier? Of course, the rich people aren't likely to use the F word or, or anything like that. They tend to have very clean sounding, posh sort of language, if you know what I mean. Not all of them. There's a lot that do use foul language. I've heard them, but a lot of them are really like cult, highly cultured, so to speak. But anyway, that looks really interesting. I think now we can call this quits.